Um, hi, good afternoon. Uh, I just want to share with you the Mental Health Awareness Map PH. Uh, it's a map of where the mental health resources and facilities in the Philippines is. So I made it this just uh, this May. So um, it still needs a lot of updates. Anyway, um, mental health. So I'm sure everyone of us already know what this means. So uh, let me just show you a meaning from the world, a definition from the World Health Organization. Um, in the Philippines, however, there, uh, according to a report in 2014 by the WHO, there were 2,558 suicide cases in 2012 and 2.5% and 1.7% male and female suicide rate, uh, respectively. Also, one in five Filipino adults suffer from psychiatric disorders, and 10 to 15% of uh, young children, five to 15 years old, also suffer from a certain mental health problem. And worldwide, one in 10 young people experiences a mental health problem. So also these figures, um, these figures merely tell the story of mental health in the Philippines. So um, what we do uh, as mental health advocates in the country, we encourage people to seek help. So because it's important to talk about mental health and get help early when things don't feel right. Like what we do when we have a broken bone, so we go directly to the doctor. Same with the mental with mental health. If we feel that something it's different. Let's. Uh, we encourage everyone to just seek help. However, there's a stigma on mental health. So, 31% um, of people with mental health illness say they are afraid to to seek help because of the fear of judgment from people. Uh, as for me, um, I was I was actually diagnosed with severe mental health, uh, severe depressive, major depressive disorder in 2017, but I was too afraid to to seek help uh, even before I felt it in 2015 because of the stigma. So uh, I thought the help would be far away or it would be uh, expensive. So that's why I thought of making the maps to show where the nearest help is. Um, there are actually a lot of data from online sources, even in, on Reddit and other, <laughs> yeah, on Reddit there's, there's a whole thread about it. But those are just lists. So I. I thought that if you make it into a map, you would uh, one could easily tell the locations. So here's a map. It's a map back version, and this is the cart one. So if you click on a point there, uh, the user can easily see the name of the facility, its address, contact details, the initial fee if you uh, if first go there, and the succeeding fee for the next. Um, appointments and there some some points all also have additional information like who to look for the psychiatrist that you could contact and if it's also LGBT friendly. I also added a map contrib page. It's OSM based, so other users could add points that they think could also help. So, but. Um, the points added here could, can still be validated before added to the actual map. Um, for new users, they, there I also added FAQs and contact sites and how to use the contrib, map contrib page. There, so um, in the future, I also want to encourage people to add, uh, to add uh, tags for mental health facilities. There's actually, uh, most of the points here are already tagged as amenity hospitals, but we could refine them more into adding health specialty to mental health. There, thank you.